Hello everyone and welcome back to me on Caffeine. My name is Isaac and we're back playing Feed the Beast Monster. So, last episode we uh, we went down, we got some redstone, we've made these coal machines. So now we've got a generator to uh, power our machines with coal. We've got our macerator which we can use to uh, put our ores in. It'll turn these into like unrefined ores which we can then put in our ore washing plant. Which will go through them and turn them into um, whatever. Like the, the iron ore gets turned into stone dust, tiny piles of iron dust and some purified crushed iron ore. We also planted some of these down. These are cotton seeds. And we planted some of these down. These are coal seeds. These do take quite a while to grow, I believe. So this might take a little bit of time before we actually get any coal from it. But it's fine. One day we might have like a big raging farm of coal and stuff. It'll be awesome. It'll be awesome. So what I want to do today is I kind of want to automate this a little bit more. I want to get the... Uh, I want to make some pipes and get the stuff that comes out of the macerator going back straight around into the oil washing plant. Then into a chest. And I also want to find a way to uh, get some water. Get this water just pumping straight into here. Now, I think... I've got a couple of options when it comes to pipes. I think I've got like, uh, these ones some extra utilities, yeah. And I've got the Buildcraft ones down here. And I think that's about it. It looks like we've got some from Engineer's Toolbox. And we'll probably have some from uh, Thermal Expansion as well, actually. We'll probably have, oh, what do, I, what do Thermal Expansion call them? They call them uh, item ducts. Maybe? Nope. If I have a duct. Let's, let's have a look at... Thermal expansion. Uh, where are these things? They're here. What do they call them? Item duct. Yeah, they've just got no space in them. Um, a solomatic server to upgrade. How much? What do these take to make? These take hardened glass, which means we have to make like a, a, an induction smelter and all that stuff. So we'll stay away from those for now. We'll go to the the buildcraft pipes, pipes because they're easy enough to do. Let's have a look. So we're gonna need our oh, stepping pipe. We're going to need a... Some, I'll make some cobblestone transport pipes to start with. Because I think I don't think we need actually to pull anything out of here. I think the macerator just sort of forces it out. And then we can just go around. So do we have any glass? Do we have any glass? Doesn't look like we do. So uh, I've got to grab a piece of sand from over here. Like this. Oh, we'll grab this one lonely piece of sand. Look at that. Lonely. The sand was so lonely. Here we go. Cook that up. And what else can we do? Oh, the water thing. I think... Uh, oh, we could go with an aqueous accumulator, actually. I was going to say a pump, but um, aqueous accumulator probably makes more sense. Tin, glass, a bucket, a pneumatic server, which we can do. And a machine frame, which we can do. Because we got some gold whilst we were down mining last time. Here it is. I'm going to quickly smelt that up. Or macerate it, shall I say. Let's macerate that. Is this done? It is. Let's see what we get if we throw some tin stuff in there like that i'm gonna make myself another chest real quick and just throw it down where's all my wood here it is i'm gonna make a chest and throw it down next to the uh, oil washer because i'm gonna get confused as to what's from the oil washer and what's not so let's come over here let's put this down say here and let's throw this stuff in like this and this and i think that's about it let's put some of our other rubbish away we don't need these or these or this stuff it's fine i'm gonna go to sleep because it's dark and they don't want to get killed and eaten alive by mobs. Or that cow who was wandering the treetops. Tarzan the cow. There we go. We've got some crushed gold ore. Uh, we're going to need some more water in here. Because this thing's got no water. Here we go. Let's do this for a bit. Because <laughs> it's fun. Here we go. Look at that. There we go. I wonder what tin's going to give us. But um, either way. Aqueous accumulator. I'm just going to take up one of these straight away and cook one up. Because we only need one piece of gold for... Um, for our machine frame, but we are going to need more glass because we need more. We are going to need more sand because we need more glass for our machine frame. So let's dig some of this up. We only need five pieces, I think. So we'll take six because why not? You know, just just because, just just because I'm crazy like that. There we go. We'll make some glass and let's make this cobblestone pipe. Let's see if this works. So glass and cobblestone inside makes us cobblestone transport pipes from Buildcraft. Uh, Work connect to stone or quartz. Nice. So now, if I do this, will this come straight out? No, it won't. Okay. So what we have to do is we have to make a wooden transport pipe, which means we need some more glass. And we have to make a redstone engine, which is okay. We can do this. Here we go. Let's take all this stuff like that. Okay, let's get ourselves a wooden transport pipe, if we can. Cook some more of that up. So a wooden transport pipe. We're going to need some wood. I think, I think any wood will do. So hopefully these planks will do. Jungle wood planks, apparently. 
Apparently, uh, rubber trees turn into jungle wood. Oh, look at this. All of our rubber trees have grown. It's awesome. I kind of want to get into um, some Tinker's Construct stuff because Tinker's Construct adds uh, an axe called a lumber axe, which uh, allows you to, like, it does what tree capitator does. So you can just hit the bottom of the tree and the whole thing falls down. And I kind of want to start using that on this. So we might move into some uh, Tinker's Construct stuff soon. So we'll take that. Do we have enough iron? We don't. But if we cook up some of our strange iron dust that we've got over here, this stuff here, the purified iron dust stuff, we'll be able to make ourselves a machine frame in no time. So what did this give us? Tin gave us purified tin, tiny pile of tins of stone dust. So they all kind of give the same thing. They just do it a little bit different. Let's take this out here. I wonder what's stopping this. Is it out of power? It is. It is. It's out of power. We could do with getting some more coal, probably, because we're running out of it very fast. I'll take some out of here. But we are running out of coal quite fast at the minute. Let's take this and now we should be able to make a machine frame uh no why can't we make a machine frame we've got glass uh do 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 what am i missing oh it's this one that's why all right there we go machine frame we also need a pneumatic server which we're gonna need some more glass for there we go pneumatic server oh we need some more iron as well gosh you know so much stuff so much stuff let's grab one of those and then can we make one of these Make a bucket. We've got one. Uh, do we have the stuff? Oh, we do. Look at this. Acris accumulator. Boom. Okay, so let's throw this thing down, say, here. I'll throw it there. And then we just need some cobblestone waterproof pipes. And we can get that by, I think we smell cactus, but I've no idea what cactus juice is. So I'm going to try that real quick. Oh, I can't try it, but I'm, I definitely want to. It's on my to-do list now. So if we smelt this down, it should turn into some pipe waterproofing or some cactus green even, which we can then turn into some pipe waterproofing. And I might have to move that actually, maybe. I'll find out in a minute. Uh, do I get one pipe waterproofing? I do, which means I think I'm only be able to waterproof three pipes. So let's pick this up. I don't have a wrench, so we have to just break it like this. Let's pick this up and let's move it to say... I'll just move it straight up here, behind it. There we go. Uh, do we have a bucket still? No, but I can make another one, I think. Maybe. Possibly. Uh, do we have enough tiny... Oh, look at this. We've got enough tiny iron to make another another iron ingot, which is awesome. Look at this. Yeah, iron dust. So then we'll just cook that up and get another iron ingot. Let's take this and make some cobblestone waterproof pipes. Kaplunk. And then, if we throw down the aqueous accumulator here, for instance, and we get we get our bucket, like so, and we grab some water, we should, this thing should start filling up with water. It does, yeah. I love this thing. It doesn't even need any power or anything. And then we can just connect this up to this, like this, and this should start getting some water. Look at that. Look at that. There we go. We've done it. We've automated the water getting of this all washing plant. Which is awesome. Awesome stuff. Okay. All right, back to where we were before. We need a wooden transport pipe, which is wood on two sides and glass. There we go. We've got some wooden transport pipes. And then we need a redstone engine. So redstone helps with a type of right engine. Here we go. We need some planks, some stuff, some pistons. Can we make one? No, we need some more wood and some more iron actually as well. Do we have any more uh, weird iron stuff? Let's see, we've got some more tin dust, some other stuff. We've got some iron here. I'll start macerating this up. We've got loads of crushed gold. Uh, we've got loads of this as well. Take these out. We could do with, like, automating this as well, actually. That'd be pretty cool. If we get enough stuff to make another redstone, redstone engine, we could always uh, have another one pumping out of here, where, maybe. I don't know what it pumps out of, actually. It might pump out of this side that we can't see, possibly. I'm not too sure. Um, I'm all new to this. So there we go. We've got some crushed iron. Let's... I'm just going to smelt this up. Save some time. Uh, how much do we need? We just need one, don't we? Because we need... Uh, or two if we want to make two of these. But yeah, we should just need one. Let's make some of these while we're waiting. Uh, I'm going to need another one, aren't I? I need two sets. So to make, to make wooden gears, you just get sticks. And like this. Just put them in like a little... Somewhat... A Minecraft circle. Which is just blocks. Uh, glass planks, we've got all that stuff. So now we're just waiting on the iron for these pistons. And my inventory is full, so I'm going to throw this wood on the floor. 
Okay, piston, can we make one? Yeah, look at that, kaboom, piston made. Then let's make ourselves one of these. No, not happening. We need to make this into planks. There we go, look at this, look at this. Okay, so redstone engine. I think I'm gonna put it underneath because it just looks nicer. And I'll put a lever there as well. Uh, let's make a stick and some cobblestone. There we go, look at this. Oh, we've lost the cactus juice. Uh, I don't want to lose my cactus juice. Uh, let's drop the eggs. Who needs eggs? So if I think if I put this there and turn that on and put this here once I put this pipe down. So let's say I put this here and I put this here. That should, oh, it does look at that. Okay, and then if we say pump this up, up and around. Oh, look at that. Look at that. It's just just a little bit off. Let's quickly go. Um, I say quickly. I don't think we'll be quick enough. Oh, I think we were. Oh, we were. Look at that. We had loads of time. So now this, it looks a bit ugly at the minute, but I think this should work. I'm hoping this will dump it into the top of, uh, of this stuff here and things will be all nice and happy. Let's just press R to organize my inventory a little bit. There we go. Uh, is this going to work? Moment of truth. Oh, it does as well. Look at that. Look at that. It's awesome. Okay, so now we've done that. We've automated our macerating and ore smelting process. Again, we're out of coal, which is a pain. We're going to run out of coal so fast. Uh, we could do with getting some sort of, like, maybe a quarry set up. Or um, we could probably do with going to the nether, actually, and getting some uh, some lava power going. Make some geothermal generators and stuff. That would be pretty cool. Uh, how are we doing for everything else? We got, we got some uranium, which seems to have changed from 1.5.2. Uh, now you get it in, like, block form instead of uh, what you used to get it in, which was, like, uh, you used to get it in, like, item form. So now you use uranium and pyrethium dust to get yellowium ingots. Ooh, okay. Or you can put it in the macerator to get crushed uranium, which can be used in a thermal centrifuge. <laughs> Gosh, look at this crazy stuff. To make um, uranium, tiny, pi tiny piles of uranium and stone dust, obviously. Then uranium can be used to make uranium blocks. It can be used to make enriched uranium. And then enriched uranium can be used to make uranium fuel cells, which can be used to make dual or quad fuel cells, which I'm assuming you can put in a nuclear reactor to uh, to blow up your world if you really want to. Or generate power. It depends how you feel about it. Look at this. We've got seven of this stuff. Gosh. There we go. We also got some cinema. We've got all this stuff here. Reactor craft. Never used reactor craft. I should probably look into it. It's been uh, it's been in quite a few of the Feed the Beast mod packs lately. It's probably pretty good. So let's take some copper. Uh, some aluminium. Actually, I don't know if you can pulverize aluminium. Um, do everything else. We don't have much else, so we can pulverize. I was thinking about just having like a chest of stuff that we put like a chest of walls that we put like. Uh, probably have to put it here on top, and it just sort of goes down into the macerator and then gets cooked through. So we can just put all our walls in here. But we probably have to do a bit more repiping before we can do that. Uh, oh, look at this! Awesome, awesome stuff. Uh, do we have what it takes to pump this stuff out? Maybe. Let's try, let's try. Um, we need a redstone engine, don't we? Which is one of these. Do we have enough stuff? I think we do, you know. Um, we can make one of those. We're going to need some more sticks to make some more stone gears. Or uh, wooden gears even, sorry. Here we go, look at that. And then, I think, if we grab a piece of glass, a piece of sand, and make it into some glass, I think we could probably make another one. Let's have a look. Let's run all the way over here. Let's take this piece of glass. There we go. Let's run back. And if we set this up right, we should be able to get another uh, redstone engine. Hopefully. Hopefully. I'm going to. Is it time to sleep? It is. It's time to sleep. I'm going to sleep. And uh, hopefully. There we go. Look at this. Okay. Is this cooked? It is. Look at that. Okay. Right. Kaplunk. And now, if we do what we did before and put. And just dig ourselves into a hole. And we make another lever. Put it down there out of the way. Turn it on. Put our redstone engine on top of this. And then put a pipe here. Hopefully that will uh, pump out the new stuff. Oh, it does as well. Look at that. It's pumping out this stuff here. And as you can see, it gets faster and faster the longer it's on. Which is pretty awesome, so it'll start pulling stuff out even faster as, as time goes by. And all of our stuff just gets straight up, pumped into there, which is awesome. And this is our power yet again. 
my gosh, this is like using so much power. But um, yeah, I'm going to call it there, guys. If you did enjoy the episode, be sure to like. And mm, before next episode, I think I'm going to go do some mining, get some more uh, coal, some more tin, iron, copper, uranium, everything in the world. And um, hopefully we'll be ready to do some even more cool stuff in the next episode.